Let me see if I can do this without dropping the phone. <laughs> hey guys, it's me. Um, it's been a long time, I know. Oh my goodness, it's been too long. I apologize for that. Uh, life has been a little crazy and this is just a, a little update video on what's going on. I'm trying not to get the car in back of me. I'm in the school line here and the way I'm parked, there's like somebody right on the side of me here. I'm trying not to get them in there. Um, so I hope you all are doing great. I know the world is just going absolutely crazy right now and has been for a while. Um, yeah. So I've been busy. Um, my goodness. The last time I was doing videos, I was doing the subscription boxes, the clothing subscription boxes. Yeah, I have, haven't been doing those like since the last video. I, I got rid of all the subscriptions. They were just not in the budget anymore and I wasn't really finding stuff. Well, excuse me, I wasn't finding clothing that I really, really loved and I just felt like it was a waste of money. So, and I just, it's hard for me to fit clothing unless I go into a store and try them on. So anyway, I'm not doing that anymore. And so what's happening, we moved. Um, we used to live in Boca Raton, Florida, which is South Florida, um, just above uh, Fort Lauderdale, Miami. And we moved about five, four plus hours north, or excuse me, northwest. So we're, I'm not gonna say name the city that we're living in, but we're like um, northwest of Tampa. So um, yeah. And we basically just needed a change. Um, South Florida is just getting too built up and too busy, like crazy busy. And it's fast paced and um, the area was, is, was very expensive. Like everything was more expensive there. Everything, like bananas expensive. So we're just like, you know what? We got to simplify our lives, get rid of just, just simplify, you know, <laughs> can you identify with me? So that's what we did. We found, um, found this house in a great neighborhood and quiet. Um, the city's very more slower paced and quiet and, um, just it, it like the people seem I, I know I don't know if this is true or not but it just seems like everybody's nicer here I mean of course you're gonna run into a jerk every now and then that's just for human right but it, it you can just feel a difference when you come here um these smaller towns this is just <clears throat> people just seem to be nicer and driving is so much I don't know you you get what I'm saying though it's just yeah and we took the kids obviously we left so the kids were in public school and we felt very strongly to get them into a christian school and actually we live very close to my husband's brother moved here several years ago so he him and his wife and son um who is basically let's see Eli just turned eight in August and his cousin um, is turning eight in October so they're two months apart and so we got them into the school that um, their cousin goes to which is a really nice Christian private school and it's just the difference is night and day like I don't even know I mean, the school is much smaller, which makes a huge difference. I mean, the, the other school they went to was huge and there's just a lot of kids and <clears throat> the school's much, much smaller and um, they're getting, you know, learning about God and Jesus, which is a huge, huge thing that like, to me, that's the most important thing. Like math, reading, writing, yeah, it's important, but to Mark and I, it's the most important thing is learning about God. So 
that is happening. Oh, and we also, um, we're planning on, um, we, we did actually buy a chunk of land. We did that before we, we bought this house because we were gonna build on this land and build the house remotely from Boca, but we just decided it's just way too much. So um, once we start build, once we get this, the new house built, <laughs> it's confusing, I know. Once we get the new house built on the property, we're gonna rent out our current house for income. So, but the, the property, I mean, it, it's a little, it's uh, in the town next to this town. So it's, it's close and it is, um, it's like four and a half acres or no, three, I'm sorry, three, almost four acres. So, and there's a little creek and everything, and it's just a little bit more country. I mean, I don't know. We're planning on doing some homesteading and, you know, getting some chickens, maybe goats. I don't know. We'll see. And just kind of try to grow some around food, and so it should be fun. So, oh my goodness, yeah, that's happening. And it's just the craziness with this COVID. Oh my God. Like people are way more relaxed here. Um, there aren't as many cases here too. So South Florida was bonkers for a while. It was like people were so crazy. And um, yeah, and the, the schools down there, they're not, they're virtual. I mean, at least this school gave us the option um, to send them to school or they could do virtual learning, which so we chose for them to go in person and masks aren't mandatory. They can wear masks or they don't, you know, it's their choice. It's our choice basically. So I don't know. <clears throat> I'm not going to get into all that with that COVID stuff, but thankfully, um, you know, By the grace of God go I, we have not, we have not been affected and I feel so bad for the people who have, um, it's just horrible, but, um, hopefully, you know, we can continue to, to stay away from it. I know I don't talk a whole lot on my channel about my faith, um, you know, I mean, every now and then I'll mention something, but lately i've been getting more reading more scripture and um even though we left our church we haven't technically left our church we're, we're still watching online and um <coughs> i used to sing with the praise team on saturday nights and i i'm you know sorry <laughs> um i really miss doing that but um we still watch my hair is a mess. I'm, I look at look at all the this is COVID hair right here. Look at this mess. But um, we still watch on Saturday or Sundays, and we still have our Bible study that we we do through Zoom because you know with COVID we started doing the meetings in Zoom, and so we're continuing with that, which is really good, and um, it's just kind of strengthened our faith even more and um i've just been really getting into scripture and i'm feeling more and more convicted um about sharing the gospel and sharing god because so far i mean i don't have a whole lot of friends outside of um you know church and yeah we, we don't do that much we're hermits so i haven't really had the opportunity to share my faith and um i'm feeling very convicted to do that and um because i'm getting older i mean i am <laughs> i'm gonna be 50 next month or next month next year and not only that i mean i'm, I'm not gonna go into end times and stuff but i i do believe that we're we're close i mean and i just feel that much more of a calling to kind of share the gospel and um that's what we're called to do you know that's the great commission right so yeah I'm going I want to make a video 
um, or at least start to make videos about that. And, um, you know, if you're interested, let me know if you're interested in something like that and just try to, to talk about it more and maybe talk about misconceptions about the Bible, misconceptions about Christians. And, um, so I don't know, just putting that out there. So what's going on with you guys? Oh, here comes the lady. <laughs> She's gonna, she comes around and get the names of the kids to get them ready, so. I really miss doing videos. It's funny because um, Eli, he has a YouTube channel and um, it's Eli plays with a Z games and he loves Roblox and he's been doing videos, Roblox videos and like toy videos, like playing and stuff. And I've been like, that is so much work. I, I don't, <coughs> I gotta move my car up. I forget how much work goes into making videos. So, but he gets so excited whenever he gets a new um, view or comment. He's like, oh, somebody commented. And um, that's pretty hilarious. <clears throat> okay, I had to move the car up. Sorry, guys. People are probably looking at me like I'm crazy. Oh, I think my sister-in-law's over there. <laughs> and it's funny because um, their cousin is in second grade. Eden's in first grade, their cousin's in second grade, and Eli's in third grade. So whenever they see the name, and <clears throat> they get the kids mixed up. It's funny, but it's weird because Eli is only two months older than their cousin, and he's in third grade. So, like, literally, if Eli was born when he was supposed to be born, he would have been <clears throat> in a grade lower. Sorry, it's not COVID. Allergies. <clears throat> you have to explain that to people when they, you start coughing and sneezing. Yeah, I don't know what I was talking about. Oh, I was talking about Eli's little YouTube channel. Yeah, it's so funny. But I've, I've just been really focusing on them and focusing on... You know, the summer was so long and so long. <laughs> and the move and I'm still unpacking. I mean, I'm just about done, but you know, I'm part sloth. So I, I move at a sloth's pace, <laughs> um, but it's getting, it's getting there. All the living space is done. It's just the, the spare room is lots of storage and I have to go through some stuff. I think that's all I have. I just wanted to update you guys and let you know I'm here. I'm good. Everything's great. Um, this angle's not very... There. See, that would have been better to do the video like that. But no, you're all under here. And that's just not... That's not pretty. <laughs> Whatever. It is what it is, right? So, yeah. Um, let me know how you guys are doing. And it... Um, I don't know what I'm going to do with the channel. Like, I want to do more videos. And I really, really, really wanted to do... I, I, I want to do, like, craft um, tutorials and, like, crochet tutorials. And I <clears throat> have big plans. It's just going through with them is, is, is hard. <laughs> but I'm going to work on it. So, and... Um, I have, you know, lots of things with the hu hubby I have to do, and, you know, we have lots of uh, projects around the house. Look at this hair. Look how white. Oh, my gosh. Crazy. <laughs> all right. I'll stop. All right, guys. So, I think that's all I have. And um, remember, I love you, and God bless you all.